Hello all and welcome to another Kevin Entertainment video. It's Art here with my summer reading of summer reading adult reading program from my local library. First things first, here's the folder for it. I'm showing the back so that nobody can because um, the name of the library is on there and I, I, and I think they put the address on there. So I'm showing the back just for my own privacy and safety. But it's there, and inside inside here are two things, one of which is in my hand here. The other is stapled in the sheet. This is the uh, eight books. In here is the, is the eight books I need to read. Well, any eight books I want can be titled and uh, done. The, the motto for this is read, return, and repeat. So... Um, you get to pick eight books. You have to have the title, your name, your phone number, and the prize number because there's eight, eight or eight or nine or ten different prizes, prize packs. You get to choose from like a Barnes and Noble gift card, a travel mug cup, a tote bag with other stuff. So I'll make those decisions of what prizes I want to pick from. But that's all that's in here. Excuse me, I'm leaning over quite a bit. All right, let me fix this. Um, but that's what that is right there. And then one of the other fun things that you get to win prizes for is um, my local branch of my local library is doing book bingo. So there's... A B, a B line, an I line, N line, G line, an O line, and in each line there's one, two, three, four, five spots with the, of course, the middle of the N being the free space. <clears throat> Let me grab this up. Here is this just to prove that it exists. I don't know how well you guys can see it. I'll read it out to you in just a second. But here this is. And I'm going to explain how this ties into my Star Trek Litverse attack plan as well. So in B there's recommended by a little friend. Uh, recommended by a friend. There's color in the title, based on the true story, love triangle, and published in the year you were born. So we've got that in that. In the I, there is new release, historical fiction, your favorite author, chosen based on the cover, beach read. In N, there's bestseller, made you laugh out loud, free space, first book in a series, and a classic. In G, there's Nonfiction, um, one word title, more than 300 pages, is set in the future, became a movie. In O, they're set in another country, biography, female author, mystery or thriller, reread a book you read as a child. So, here's how this is going to work. Now, it says here, uh... The rules for are, after you read a book from the above categories, stop by uh, the local branch of your library to get a, uh, to get the spare stamped. And when uh, you have bingo, you win a prize. They're not telling me what the prizes are for bingo, but I've been told they're pretty good. But, um... Based on a true story, I am actually reading for the book club. That's going to be um, Murder in Little Egypt. New release is going to be, uh, I've already read, it's going to be First Frost. Your favorite author, I'm going to use Peter Allen David's uh, New Frontier uh, series, because Peter Allen David is my favorite Star Star Trek author. I almost said Star Wars, but Star Trek author. Um, best seller 
I haven't picked one yet. Made you laugh out loud. Haven't picked one yet. First book in the series is probably going to be uh, Star Trek A Diplomatic Immunity. It's the first in the IKS Gorkon series of Star Trek books. Uh, classic. I don't know what I'll read for that. Nonfiction is probably going to be uh, Business is about to pick up by Jim Ross. One word title is probably going to be Star Trek Vanguard. More than 300 pages is probably going to be uh, Star Trek Glass Empires because it's like almost 500 pages. Set in the future, I'll just throw in a random Star Trek book. Became a movie. Uh, I might reread Doom this year, which could also land in for the classic. Uh, set in another country is probably going to be Turn a Blind Eye. I'm not going to put any covers up because I'm just going through this and spitballing because I may not uh, be able to do anything. Uh, covers this fast mystery or thrower is going to be easy. Uh, reread a book from your childhood <clears throat> is probably going to be Star Trek um, Dark Mirror because I got it on Kindle Unlimited and I read it as a kid because I own it. And I loved that book. It was read by Diane Duane, so she could be the female author. Also, Diane Carey, Susan Wright writes One Small Step. Could work there, too. Published in the year you were born. Um, I'll probably pick something from 82 that's up my alley and just read it and love it. And, well, hopefully love it. Uh, read it. But I look to actually probably get a lot of these done. Now, why am I going over this? Uh... For one thing, to show you guys that I'm going to use it to further the attack plan plan. For two things, because there's two squares here where I don't have anything that is recommended by a friend. So, recommend a book. It can be in the Star Trek Lit Burst. It can be outside of the Star Trek Lit Burst. Recommend it in the comments down below and I might pick your book to read in There You Go. Uh, and also Love Triangle. If you can think of a Love Triangle that's either Mystery Thrower or Science Fiction Fantasy, we'll put that in the comments down below so you guys have two assignments. But that's what I'm going to be doing. I have to get this all turned in by July 31st, so we got two months to go. Signed up for it the first week it was up. Already got one square marked off in new releases in First Frost. So, um... Like I said, you guys can, in the B line, you guys can recommend a uh, title for me to read if you guys want to do it as one of the Star Trek Lit Burst series. I would love that. And then the Love Triangle, as long as it's science fiction or mystery, we could handle, handle that out and be good with that. Although I might do R.R. Verdi's um, first binding for... Recommended by a friend because my good friend Cody who works at my local books bookstore did recommend that to me I do have it on audible. I am uh, Going to get back to it and get it done And I'm gonna go see my boy Cody and tell tell him either how good or how bad it was I don't know yet because I haven't finished it, but uh, the, But also leave it in the comments down below because I might change so leave two suggestions in the comment down below one for love triangle and one for recommended by a friend but that's the plan. Hopefully your library does some adult reading program. Because it's good to just have missions and goals and, and in reading. And why not try to win a prize while you're at it. But until next time. You know I make videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday. 12.30 p.m. Central, 10.30 a.m. Pacific, 1.30 p.m. Eastern. Please like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more. Please ding the notification bell to be notified when I upload a video. And without further ado, happy reading! We're going to have a fun two months, and you can bet your bottom dollar that bingo is going to be in the July monthly reading room. As we had the full month of July to read it, so you can bet your bottom dollar that's going to happen. But until next time, happy reading! I'll see you again soon, and peace!